All the skaters look really nervous. There's always a real nervous race. You cannot make a mistake. Every relay, every push has to be good. And they're off. Yeah, we see on the comments a lot of fans from Argentina. Unfortunately, they are not in this final. But we have Germany, Colombia, Chile, South Korea, Belgium, and Chinese Taipei. Yeah, and like Titia Simek from Germany took the lead from the start. And it's now Sabine Berg from Germany who is in the lead. In front of the Colombian skaters, Chile, South Korea, Belgium, and Chinese Taipei. Yeah, and Uncle Foss from Belgium is moving up now. Pushing Sandrine Tass. And we see the pack all together. Yeah, and China. we see the world champion on the 1,000 meter, Marijke Tum in third position. And this girls will finish this race. Yeah, followed by the world champion on the elimination race. Still Belgium in the lead, but there comes South Korea. South Korea is on the outside and will go in the corner in first place. So 11 laps to go, 11 laps to go. South Korea is leading in front of Belgium. It's all close together. It's not a really fast race, so it's a tactical race now. And how will this turn out to the final? Yeah, Chile is moving up to the front now. But they didn't have a really good chance. So we see them in fourth now, Colombia in front, followed by South Korea, Belgium. Yeah, we go to the next relay with the board on nine. Belgium is on the inside and Colombia is on the outside and takes the lead now. Colombia in first position, followed by South Korea. Three more laps for each skater. Fabriana Arias from Colombia in the lead now. Yeah, and all the skaters are really close together. It's going to be a really close finish. I think the speed is not really high. They're still waiting. They're still waiting to go. Yeah, Colombia had a little gap, but everybody is passing now, and they are in fourth, fifth. They didn't pay attention to the other skaters, and they're in the back of the pack now, or in the back in third position. And the Belgian girl, Sandrine Tass, is in fourth position right after the Colombian girl. She has to finish it up. Has, does she have enough speed to do it? So, and for the first time, we see Chinese Taipei. They took the lead, but Colombia is back. Colombia is back in the lead, followed by Chinese Taipei. And Chinese Taipei, the favorite of the summer. Can they beat the Colombian girls? Yeah, we see Shimek from Germany and Chile in a problems, but they had a really good push. So some Sabine Berg is back, and also the girl from Chile is back. Yeah, and the speed Ooh, is... Oh, and we have a crash. crash. A crash Chinese from... Taipei. Oh, and Belgium, and Chile, and Germany. It's a complete mess. Oh, but Germany is still in the race. It was the other girl who crashed. So we have Colombia in the lead now, in front of South Korea. And Marijke Thum. Marijke Thum from Germany is in third position, followed by Sandrine Tass. Yeah, and Fabriana Arias is going full gas now, followed by the girl from South Korea. It's a battle between Colombia and South Korea. And Chinese Taipei is out of the race. They crest. They cannot get a medal anymore. Colombia is in the lead, followed by South Korea. And I think the gap is bigger and bigger. Bigger, yeah. It, the gap is getting bigger. And Sabine Berg from Germany is in third position now. And the Belgium have to catch them. Yeah, will the Korean ladies come back or not? They finish up with a sprinter. But can she beat Joanna Viveros from Colombia? The gaps are so big. Colombia gold, South Korea silver, and bronze goes to Germany. Yeah, the gold medal for Colombia, but what a bad crest. What a pity from the girls from Chinese Taipei. And an other medal for Marijke Thun. She takes bronze now with her team. First gold medal in the relays for Colombia. Yeah, that's a 
surprised they didn't take another medal with the juniors, but it's the first medal, but it's well deserved, I think. They looked the strongest. They had a big gap on South Korea. Yeah, it was a clear win, like the Korean guys did in the junior. But also the Korean girls are really happy. Yeah, and there are the Belgian girls. Fourth place. It's the worst place, I think, on the relay. Yeah.